6 Ways to Protect Yourself from Online Catfishing Scams Cybersecurity is a growing field with various developments taking place every day. Hackers devise novel means to break into your system. One such method is catfishing scams. In this blog, we have tried to explain what exactly is catfishing and how you can stay protected from this. So let's start. Catfishing scams in simple terms means using fake images and information to formulate a fraudulent identity on the internet. A catfish will try to steal some other person's personal information including name, pictures, emails, etc. to create their own identity. Once they devise this fake ID they might indulge in business or for another purpose. Catfishing scams is a popular cybercrime used in social media and dating apps. On dating apps, catfish pose as someone else and make the other person a victim of a romance scam. It is important to note that catfishing is not only used for crimes but is also used by people who are not confident about themselves. How do catfish scams work? Catfish pose as a legitimate people and can make the other person trust them into giving personal information or be a victim of theirs. They can make the victim give them money or some other personal information. Now, catfish might use this information to perpetrate greater cyber crimes like ransomware, malware, etc. While some catfish might be innocuous, nonetheless, it is important to stay informed about how to tackle them. How to protect yourself from catfishing scam. Conduct a background check. The first way to detect if any person is legitimate or not is to conduct a background check. You can use apps like Instant Checkmate or even simply type their name on Google to see their social media, etc. Thereafter, you can verify their other information like their workplace, friends, etc. to see if they are legitimate or not. Identify the signs of catfish. If the catfish is using detailed information, it might be tricky to identify them. As catfish are intended to target specific people, they might not have a lot of followers or posts. Also, they might not be ready to meet or indulge in video calls. These are some other signs to identify catfish. Never give out your personal information. Divulging your personal information to strangers is always risky. If someone you just met online asks you for your personal information and prods you to share other information in a short span of time, chances are they might be catfishing you. If they ask you for a password saying it's an emergency, it is a red flag that they are catfish. Always be vigilant while you share your personal information online. Always be suspicious of new people. Whenever you get a friend request or message from unknown people, be suspicious and do not trust them immediately. While it is completely fine to meet new people but always be vigilant and careful while interacting with new people. Question them. If you are doubtful about a certain person, ask them questions that only that particular person would know. You can ask them about the restaurant or the specific places of the place they claim to be. If they try to evade questions or give wrong answers, be careful. Employ reverse image search. Social media makes use of fake images. If you sense the person you are talking to is fake, try a reverse image search to see if their picture is fake or not. This mechanism also identifies whether the picture is authentic or not by comparing it to similar images. If you happen to be a victim of catfish, you can incur losses and even have heartbreak. To keep yourself protected, stay informed, and be watchful about whatever happens on the internet. At CISVUD, we are dedicated to keeping you informed about the latest happening in the field of cybercrime so that you are informed and stay protected. Also, to safeguard your system and your files, you can install CISVUD now. Thanks for watching.